Whoa, did you just see that? This literally just dropped from the sky, like, 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 you know the bird, whoo, whoo, that just dropped the baby. Same thing, it just dropped me the Oculus. I think, I think it's gone already. <laughs> What's inside of here? Of course, the Oculus Quest, the world's most powerful standalone VR headset, but not the first. The first, of course, is the Oculus Go, which is still my go-to VR headset for every practical use that I do. Why is that? Why did I get this? Mm, coming right up. Welcome back. My name, by the way, is Lazius K, and I talk about and focus on the practical uses of VR. Ooh, that's right. So remember to like and subscribe, share some love so that you and I together, we can grow the community and help as many people get into VR. That's right, that's what it's all about. Now, before we proceed, because coming right up, we are going to unbox this bad boy, the Oculus Quest. But before we do that, I really feel it's important to share with you some information. So first, why did I get this guy? What is so special about this guy? Like seriously, I, I, I use the Oculus Go. This headset for me is the perfect headset. I've used it for six months. It's been out since 2018. It has all the apps that you need to make it work. It's great for the practical uses of VR. Now, if you want something for gaming, go for this, go for the Oculus Quest, but we're not about gaming, we're here. I'm trying to educate you about how you can improve your life using VR, how you can attract more customers, more leads uh, for your business and help you to improve your skills and learning new things so you can improve your career, right? It's my duty, it's my responsibility to make sure that we do compare the latest technologies and I share this knowledge with you. So that's really why I got it. But would I get it if I wasn't doing a VR channel? Hmm. Comment below, do you think I'm gonna say yes? Comment below, do you think I'm gonna say no? No, I would not, it's that simple. If I was in VR and I wanted to get into VR or if I, if I had the Oculus Go, I'm not bothered, I would not get this. I'm really sorry, but I'm not a gamer. I'm just not a gamer. Gaming to me is, I just don't have time to play games. I'm so sorry, I have a full-time job. I, I have to do this VR essentials, all the recordings and everything. And there's so many people doing gaming already. I, I, I know to me, it's more important to try and help you find value in VR in terms of how it can help your life. I don't have time for gaming and I respect those that do gaming, but for me, it's just not my thing. So I would not get the Oculus Quest. It is that simple. If you really want cool gaming channels, go and check out Remarkers. His channel is really cool. Go and check out Cass and Chari. Those two girls from Holland are amazing and they really know what they're talking about also. Um, go and check out those two channels, absolutely amazing. But if you're looking for the practical uses, stick around, it's time to do the unboxing. DJ, cue the music, let's get this pumping. All right, are you ready to find out what's inside? We're going to take over the world with this thing. All right, welcome back. I hope you liked the montage. Remember to like and subscribe, share some love so that together we can help and get as many people into VR. Yeah, that is what it's all about. So today we have unpacked, unboxed the little sister Oculus Quest or little brother. I'm not sure. Comment below, brother, sister, to the Oculus Go. Uh, remember to watch the, whoa, click the, notifi the notification bell because of course I'm gonna do another video. I'm gonna give you my take on what it's like to wear this headset for the very first time. Remember, I bought this with my own money and I also bought this with my own money. So uh, it will be completely unbiased. It was not sent to me. Uh, for example, uh, just, you know, just like this, just to give you, give you my first impression, I can, I can smell the synthetic of the headset. 
probably stayed in the box for a while. Uh, don't know if it's chemical or something, but you know, I, I'd rather leave it out for maybe a couple days before I put it on my face for the very first time. Uh, I could be nauseous, I don't know. So, you know, I'd rather wait a little bit. So this is exactly what I'm gonna tell you in the next video. I'm gonna give you all the good stuff and all the bad stuff. The good is that, oof, it feels really, really, mm, really luxurious, like an apple or something, you know? Uh, really nice in the hands. Um, so yeah, so remember to like and subscribe, comment below. Let us know, did you, do you have a quest? What you know, tips and tricks do you have that I should be aware of the first time I put it on, uh, that other people should be aware of? Also, what kind of apps do you recommend in the Quest compared to the Go? Uh, or what apps from the Go do you recommend to use in the Quest? Leave a comment below. All right, until next time, thank you again. Thank you again for watching. Take it easy, DJ Q Music, take it away.